Captain Zero. Captain Zero. Research explorer in time and space. uncharted region of the planet called Earth stands the laboratory of Captain Zero. In this secret location, known only to a few in the outside world, Captain Zero and his associates experiment in time and space to learn from the past Projecting back into time. 1400, 1300, 12, stand by. 1180, cut the cycle reactor and lock it. Level the power, Tetro. Yes, sir. All right, Jet, stand by to activate the view screen. Yes, sir. Bring up the plate power. Increase the target voltage. There you are. Sherwood Forest, England, in the year 1180. Why? See if I can find Robin Hood? Cut the view screen, Jeff. Can I? I'm not even sure Robin Hood really lives. And if the Sheriff of Nottingham could never find him, what makes you think you can? If Robin Hood actually lived in Sherwood Forest, I'll find him. Okay, hop into the chamber. Yes, sir. Oh, and Jeff, be careful. Stay out of trouble. Yes, sir. Boy, maybe Robin Hood will actually let me join his band for a while. Stand by to materialize. Ready, Jet? There he goes. Gone. Maybe I'd better keep track of him on the view screen, just in case. Season of the year with a ninny, ninny, nanny. Hold. Who art thou? Robin Hood, men call me. And where goest thou, infant? To the shooting match at Nottingham Town. A prize has been offered. The shooting match? <laughs> and dost thou, a mere infant with scarce a fuzz on thy chin, expect to shoot with good, stout men? I'll wager I can best thee at any target. Oh? Uh -huh. Wouldst thou care to wager? Uh... Twenty pounds? Aye. Name thy mark. Look thou. At the glade's end is a herd of deer. I'll wager not one of them canst thou hit. Verily, the wager is mine. Nay, tis none of thine. A, a lucky shot, tis all. I won it fairly by thine own terms. Yeah. Well, get thee gone. Thou hast killed one of the king's deer. By the laws of our land, thine ears should be shaven close to thy head. By twenty pounds, please. Aye, infant. 
I'll give thee 20 pounds on my head. Uh. Infant am I? Now my 20 pounds, please. My men will soon give thee 20 lashes. I leave thee, sire. But I will return. Not if I can help it. Ah! What ill luck spoils my aim? You say that I am no archer. Watch thy bonnet and be glad tis not thy head. Help! Help! He tried to kill me that way! Man, I'd better get out of here. Oh, there's another! After him! This way! Flush them out, men! Shoot first, ask questions later! in Sherwood Forest. I'm going back in time. What happened? I lost track of him on the view screen and the sheriff's deputies are after him. Stand by to bring us back on signal. Yes, sir. Must be around here somewhere. He must have come through here, tripped over this log, and run across that bridge. Manner of man art thou? I'm Captain Zero, and I'm looking for the my... The Sheriff of Nottingham must be sore pressed to have the likes of thee in his service. I have nothing to do with the Sheriff, my friend. Who are you? Little John, men call me. Right-hand man of Robin Hood. Robin Hood? Where is Robin Hood? He might... Hold! Thou dost not trick me into showing me Robin Hood's hiding place. Now get thee gone before I crack thy skull. Look, Little John, I only want to cross over this bridge. Now, would you please be good enough to let me go by? I let no one the likes of thee go by. Oh? Uh, hold! We've gone far enough in this direction. Signal them in. We'll circle back. Aye. Now, they can't be far off. We'll find them. Robin Hood and his friend. Criminy. I'm lost. I don't know which way to go. If I could just find Robin Hood's camp. I'm warning thee, whoever thou art. One more step, and over you go. Thou art a knave and a culprit. Thou didst trick me at mine own game. So long, little John. Enjoy your swim. <laughs> Nowhere twixt here in Canterbury Town is there a man could do to me what he has done. Strange indeed, this Captain Zero. Robin Hood should know of this. What is Zero doing here? Something is amiss. Hold! Look now, the father of Robin Hood's companion. He must have come through here and, and crossed John Bridge. <sighs> this way, men. Now we're on the trail. Shoot them on sight!
Leslie, what a way to end the life, Leo. What think thee, Friar Tuck? Methinks we should find this man in strange clothing who tossed you off the bridge. Methinks he is a spy for the Sheriff of Nottingham and should be captured before he discovers our hideout. What of the other deputies in the forest? Oh, they are too slow and stupid. It is the stranger, I fear. He thinks we should steal forth now, one by one, and search him out. Aye. Whoever finds him will blow two blasts on his horn to bring the others. Aye. 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 Jeff's uniform. What in the world are you doing here? Hold, Violet! Hold, Violet! Or a gray goose shaft will find thy back! Man, if I could just capture that spy, maybe Robin Hood would make me a lieutenant. Oh, pull it out! There. Oh. oh, and from now on, look before thou shootest. If my breeches were not of leather, I'd be in a sorry plight. As it is, I shall be unable to sit down for a fortnight. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were the spy. Aye. We must continue the search. But thou goest in that direction, I go in this. Cry came from about here, but certainly no sign of Jet. Oh, hold! Oh. Uh, thee again! Why, well, you see. How long hast thou been in Robin Hood's band? Verily, I... I'm sorry. Oh, never mind. Look now. I will search uh, from here to the creek. Thou searchest forward to the oak grove. Yes, sir. I mean, I. And look sharp. He thinks the spy is close by. I. Wish I had a ray gun instead of these arrows. What sayest thou? Oh, I, I just said I'm not very good with these arrows. Uh, aye. On second thought... Uh, Mayhap uh, we should search together. Only thou goest first. How now? What's this? Verily, the spy's jerkin. Friar Tuck, what goest? Where be the spy? Dost thou recognize this jerkin, little John? Aye. The spy's jerkin. I would know it anywhere. Now look ye all. The spy who wore this jerkin may now be clothed as one of us. And if he be found in Robin Hood's band, he'll wish he'd never seen this land. Aye. 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 This way, man! This way! <laughs> I would give up this job. All right, men, back to the other side.
grabs one of them. After him! Criminy, I've got to get out of Sherwood Forest and fast. Hold, my young friend. I fear thou hast reached the end of thy trail. But... Oh, no, one of the sheriff's deputies. Thou art indeed a mighty one for thy size. Well, and surely thou canst be no spy for the sheriff, since thou didst fail one of his men. Hold, they come again. Hide quickly. I'll lead them away. This way, hurry! I saw two of them! On your feet. And don't try any tricks. Well, leave me thinking I've had it. On your feet. You're my prisoner. Aye, forsooth. I think I'll live longer as a prisoner than as a deputy. Stop my weapon. Else this sword cleave thee in two. Uh, good work. Uh, this makes two of them I have captured. <laughs> the sheriff will reward me well. The great little John is already in the hands of the posse. I'll take this dangerous one back to Nottingham. You join the others and take care of Little John. Verily, here we go us again. And thou best move along without delay. If thou wouldst live another day, march thou. Hold. Keep thy hands up. Robin. Hi. Thou must be the stranger of whom Little John spoke. Didst thou not knock him off John Bridge? Yes, he refused to let me cross. <laughs> no, Mary, fight it must have been. Would that I had seen it. You mind if I lower my hand? Oh, keep thy hands up. Prior Tuck says thou art in league with the sheriff who is seeking my hiding place. What canst thou say for thyself? Prior Tuck is wrong. I'm looking for my young assistant, Jet. Jet? Yes, you know him? Why, he appeared near my camp, half clothed and half torn, with the sheriff's deputies close behind. I bid him join my band neath the greenwood tree. I've not seen him since. Maybe he's still there. Aye, follow me. Robin! The sheriff's deputies have captured little John and the lad called Jet. When? Even now they leave the forest for Nottingham. Then we must gather the band and storm the jail. Wait, you're taking a needless risk. We risk for each other that we might live in peace. Wait a minute, let me handle this. I think I can rescue both little John and Jet without anyone getting hurt. No, but how? Just give me one hour and you'll have your answer. But... Thirty minutes! Very well. But if thou shouldst fail, the sheriff will show thee no mercy. I know. I'd fairly well, then. Though I fear thou wilt fail, how can one man storm Nottingham jail? So, the great little John, Robin Hood's right-hand man. Come, Barnet, tell me a merry tale of thy strength and prowess. Thou wilt live to regret this. Robin Hood will make thee wish thou had never been born. Thee and thy Robin Hood. Before this day is over, thee, Robin Hood, and his entire band will be swinging from my favorite tree. But why? What have we done? What hast thou done? Thou hast obstructed justice, that's what. Thou hast prevented me from taking people's farms and property when they fail to pay their taxes. Thou dost know they cannot pay. Thy taxes are far too high. My word is law in this county. The taxes will be as high as I wish. Thy Robin Hood even giveth money to the poor so they may keep their lands. If were not for him, half this county would be mine and the people did it by slaves. I would be rich, rich! Do you call that justice? Aye. Justice is for those who can avoid it. You're insane. Now oh, use thy tongue wisely, lad. Thou wilt not use it long. Keep thy hands off of him, thou coward. He thinks I've had enough of thy insolence, little John. Thou hast spoken thy lies. Hold! Who art thou? How did thou get past my guard? How dare thee question the king's official? Hast thou been so lax in thy duties that thou dost not recognize our new uniforms? Verily, I, I did not know there had been a change. I have come for thy prisoners. My prisoners? Let me see thy papers. Papers? And since when does an official of the court need papers? But, but... I've I... had enough of thy insolence. Or shall I report thee to the king? No, no, verily. I've, 
and had enough trouble at court. Then release thy prisoners. But, sire... Thy keys. Or must I report thee for disobeying orders? Very well, but this is most irregular. Captain Zero, what art thou doing? Hold! Captain! So thou didst think to trick me. I'll show thee whoever thou art. Help! Guard! Guard! Out the back way. Hurry, little dog. I am hyphen. Hurry this way, quickly! Petro, take us back! Hold! Outside, quickly! Get the other guards! Surround the jail! They can't be far! How now? These, these shackles are still locked! But how... Don't. Repair thy ways, thou tyrant's name. Else this day's sun sets on thy grave. Tyrant Robin Hood! Guards! 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 Why, that sheriff really does sound insane now. He is insane with greed for money and power. But Robin Hood will take care of him. Golly. Robin Hood spent his whole life fighting for justice, didn't he? Yes, Jess, like many others. And the fight for justice still goes on. when we again transmit you to this remote location on the planet Earth, where Captain Zero and his associates will conduct another experiment in time and space.